This is this is flipping mental. Come on, who's gonna win? The Abyss Walker King or the Furious Rot? No, come on, guys. Hi guys, what is up and welcome back to another Mob Battle Mondays on the channel with me, KD Minecraft, bringing you the latest and greatest in Mob Battle experiences. <laughs> yeah, we are back this week guys, doing more of the good stuff, the stuff you love to see. And today's suggestion is brought to us by Tim Skotowski. I feel like I've nailed that. I feel like I nailed that pronouncing right there, pronunciation right there. Uh, so, Tim, this one is for you today, and we are going to be doing the Choco Quest or Chocolate Quest Report mod uh, versus the Moses Mobs mod. Uh, that has been the suggestion today, and uh, you'll see how I'm going to st structure today's battle. I've set certain mobs against other mobs just to get you a bit more of a variety of the different mobs from each mod. Uh, yeah, so it gives you guys a bit of a greater look at the different individual mods. So, that is what we are going to be doing today. And, uh, guys, if you are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell, then slap that like button. You know what I do. Because, you know, once you've done that, you too can have your suggestions appear on this beautiful board. You know you wanna. Alright, let's get up into the arenas. And, uh, yeah, let's do the battlings. So, the mobs I have selected today are these. So, I have Giant Lava Fish going against the Falaith. I have a Triton going against the Barakawana. I have a giant tortoise going against the Barakawa, the Sun Chief. And then I have a Biss Walker King going up against the Furious Rotnot. And then I have Lich going up against the Naga. And then I have Shelob, the Spider, going up against the Frostmoor. So it is going to be pretty, pretty exciting to get today, guys. So make sure to stick around for the whole thing. You know you don't want to miss out. All right, let's do this thing. So we have a giant silverfish, which is looking... Oh, it's a lava silverfish as well. So boom, it's pretty nifty. Look at this guy. He is massive. All right, and then now we have Falaith. All right, let's do these things. Do it. Battle, I believe in you. Don't just vibe with each other. I feel like they're dancing together. It's, I'm getting a vibe that they're now dancing. Like, they're both grooving to some sort of hidden beat that I do not know about. Uh, are you guys going to attack each other? Because that would be pretty sick right about now. Oh, I do love it when they do this. Alright, I'm just going to push you towards the Falaya. Oh, it's on. Flipping heck. What? Are you serious? The Falaith lost, like, no health? Are you serious? Right about now? What? Okay, um... Let's... Did, did the Falaith seriously, like, two-hit the sil the lava silverfish? Honestly. Uh, what? I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. This is gonna be fun. Okay, so I'm gonna place a maze of Falaith round. Uh, come on around here uh, let's do it let's have some around here let's have some around here uh, and then let's go for a few lava silverfish so let's see if the lava silverfish are going to do any attacking or they all just they've all just been absolutely murked okay uh wow okay i'm gonna have to give it to the the falaiths which i don't think i've ever said ever in my life, I'm doing more battles. The fly of one around. Because seriously. Okay, so these zombie diamond warriors maybe be able to take down the Falaiths. Uh we shall okay, yeah, boom, boom, taking down those those ones. Uh maybe I need to do like a greater circle of Falaiths. Maybe if I like put them all surrounded around these guys, that might be the ticket. Okay, so let's go for it round here like this. So now there's a circle. So the diamond zombie peoples have no choice but to fight the Falaiths. They are doing quite well. I'm still going to give the battle whatever happens to the Falaiths today. Flipping hell, they're breaking their armor like nothing. Damn. Damn, the Falaiths are strong. When have they ever been this good? Honestly, never. Seriously. Okay, let's take these out. Okay, nope, nothing wants to go away in peaceful. Love it. 
Okay, that's just going to have to vibe there. You can vibe. You can vibe. Uh, you will have to die. You can vibe. Uh, Alright, excuse me, Mr. Falayas. I can't bother to get the actual Moses clear a mob stick out. Can't be bothered for that. Alright, so, wow. Wowzers. Falayas into the winner section. Never have I ever said that in my entire life. Wow. Okay, let's do it. Let's get out the Triton. It's like Zoidberg from Futurama is the vibe I'm getting right now. And he has stuff he's ready to throw. Okay, so we're now let's get out the Barakawanas and let's do it. Okay, they're going for him. They're going for him. Triton. Use your throwy stuff. Use your throwy stuff, Triton. Poison them. Do, do stuff. Okay, there it goes. Okay, it was a little... <laughs> It was a little too late, Triton. It's like, as soon as he decided, you know what, I might want to fight now. It was a, no, nah, I can't be bothered. Oh, my goodness. Okay, let's try it again. I mean, technically, I feel like these Tritons are actually friendly. I feel like I've read that these are actually a friendly species. And now I've just put them to be massacred. Okay, nice one, Kieran. You know what, we're going to swap out the Triton as well. We're going to get a bit of a fairer fight, I reckon. Uh, so what we're going to say, should we say we'll get out? Oh, I'm not too sure. The Triton, yeah. Oh, he's still alive. He's still freaking alive. Gosh damn. Dude, dude's doing all right. He's, yeah, I'm going to let him chill there for a bit. Uh, what do we want to get out? Do we get out a boar man or what we saying? Maybe, no, we've done that. We sort of don't really want to do that one. Let's go for a boar man. Let's do this guy. So this guy's got 50 HP, so this should be worth- Whoa! Did you just take my mob- Dude, just took my mob battle stick. Give that back. Stop- Stop it. Stop it. I'm trying to- Trying to hit you with it. Don't want to- I really don't want to give it to you. Uh, alright, where's the shield dude? Okay, here we go. Okay, yep, now they're going for the boar dude. Okay, go on, boar man. Be boary and attack and kill them or not. Or not. Oh, yeah, I can finally take this guy out now. No, damn it. Uh, Ball Man is just taking a battering. I'm not going to lie. He is taking an absolute beating from the Barra Kiwanis. And I'm going to have to get out of something else. Because I want there to be an actual fight. I don't want to just linger. Uh, so what do we have? Uh, a Ball Mage. Maybe get one of those bad boys out. Let's get out of the Pirate Captain. I don't have that lined up for later. All right. So, flipping it. What? peaceful I wonder if flipping heck when did I swap to peaceful I never swapped to peaceful did I am I going crazy today guys it's been a long weekend have I gone absolutely mental uh, okay okay so now everyone's gonna attack everyone okay I see how we freaking is okay we'll take him out and we'll spawn him in again and I'll tell you what oh no we've got the pirate captain stuff it it's on uh, here we go there we go. They're going to absolutely fight the pirate captain and all perish now. Dramatically. The pirate captain is just murk these guys like it's nothing. It must have been because I accidentally had it on peaceful. Did I do that earlier? Was that... I must have accidentally said it and forgot to reset it back. It's probably what happened. I feel like we need a rematch. So let's get out the Triton again, wherever this guy is. We definitely. I feel like we definitely need a rematch. Uh, there you go. Alright, so let's get out of the Triton, let's get out of these guys, and let's get the battle commenced. Okay. Yep, this seems a bit more like it. Go, Triton, go! Go, Triton, go! Dude's now murking them. He is taking no prisoners anymore. Flipping it. Okay, so he's healed up, so that's what his potion was. And now he's going off to the parrot. The parrot literally has nothing to do with this. Okay, damn, the Triton is now dead. Okay. Okay, so I'm glad we've sorted that one out, so I can finally take these guys out. Oh, now we can progress on with the next battle. Perish, damn it, pirate, parrot, flipping heck, that was not needed. Okay, let's throw all this up here. So, Barakwana, we're going to give that win to you as well. At the moment, the Moses mobs are smashing it. But I reckon that is all about to change, because we're getting to the bosses right about now. So we have a giant tortoise versus a sun chief. What could possibly go wrong with this? Am I in the bubble as well? I feel like I'm in the bubble. I'm definitely in the bubble. Why am I in the bubble with you? Flipping tortoise. Okay, damn. Okay, sun chief is down. Tortoise is flying around like an absolute maniac. 
uh, but is currently on fire. Uh, oh damn, the Sun Chief is going for another laser beam of death. Uh, that's what I like to call it anyway. Uh, Tortoise, not having a good time. Not loving life down there. He is taking damage. The Sun Chief, how you doing, broski? Let's go check you out and see what your health stats are like. Uh, you are only, you, damn, you only got 25% health left. But for whatever reason, the Tortoise has decided to halt its attack progressions and is now on 64% health and dropping rapidly. Uh, I don't know why the tortoise has suddenly decided it doesn't want to fight, uh, but that is going to be its biggest mistake. Come on, let me hit you. There you go. All right, so they are both hit with a mob battle stick, so I don't quite know why the tortoise has suddenly gone, nah, not really feeling this battle anymore. This isn't really up my street. I'm not sure it's because he thought it was too easy. Maybe he's waiting for a final killing blow, like a real spectacular thing. But I don't know. At the moment, the Sun Chief is murking this dude. Uh, it's quite embarrassing. Oh, damn, Tortoise is going to die. Uh, flipping heck, come on. I had high hopes for you, Mr. Tortoise. You have let this show down dramatically. I think he, he has regen, actually. Flippin' heck, he has regen. Um, oh, damn, he's back up to 40% health. Uh, so he's taken a healing potion, I presume, because pretty much what I can tell from the chocolate re or report quest, chocolate quest report, there we go, I can pronounce it correctly, uh, they all have, when close to death, a uh, healing potion on them to heal themselves back up. I'm not quite sure on the amount of times they can do that. If you guys can give me information on that, like, can they do that multiple times? Because it's seeming like he is. Uh, this is going to go on for a while if he can continue to do that. Uh, flipping hell, the Barracon Sun Chief is battering this dude like nothing. Honestly, he is going to town on him. Uh, okay, he's throwing out little helpers. Uh, maybe the little helpers are now going to go over there and help out. No, they're just going to stand there. He just wants a little cheering. He just wants a little fandom to help him on. Maybe a little motivation. Alright, so Tortoise, I really hope you don't do the hearts anymore. Otherwise, this battle is going to take forever. Alright, 13% health, 12% health, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, death. Boom. Wowzers. Flipping heck. And heck, and let's see what this guy's dropped us actually. I want to see what I can pick up. So we've got slime blocks, and we've got some diamonds, and we've got tortoise scales. Lovely. Uh, so now this guy is going after the flyers. Love it. Um, yep, yeah, I'm gonna kill you before you kill everything in this arena. Good, they've all died along with him. Okay, so yet another one to the Moses mobs. I'm very surprised by that. Very surprised, but this is going to change everything. Because I'm sorry, the Abyss Walker King has to physically win this one. Quite frankly. Uh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, no. What the hell did you take? Did you, did you take my mob battle stick? What? There we go. Okay. Did we did we swap, like, items? Did, what the hell happened here? Is he... What? What the... I don't quite get what has just occurred um i have no idea what just happened there uh it took my mob battle sick is what i can tell um don't know why don't know how but very confused uh this guy's health still 100 percent cool all right let's try it again uh so let's go for you and go for you okay there we go uh, I didn't know they could take my mob battle sticks. I didn't feel like that was a fair fight if he had my mob battle sticks. So, yeah. All right. So, Abyss Walker King is losing the health. Uh, what is Furious Rock not doing? He's, he's got 80%. Okay. Damn. D damn. Okay. I really hope the Abyss Walker King smashes this one. And, guys, let me know below, like, what the Frizz Frasm. Let me know below, like, what uh, chocolate quest you prefer, the 1.7.10 version or this 1.12.2 report version. I'm not too sure. I probably prefer some... I oh, it's so hard. I 
I probably prefer the characters and the structures from the 1.7.10 version, I do have to say. Uh, but it's still pretty good, this 1.12.2, that we can use it for mob battles. So that is still pretty awesome, I've got to say. Like, I really like being able to use the Chocolate Quest mod for mob battles. And for whatever reason, they're turning my screen black. Alright, so he's spawned in some helper mates. Uh, I understand. They're not really helping out, though. They're sort of just death, dead, flip, and heck. Uh, damn, I did not know the Abyss Walker King could do lightning like that. Furious Rortnor is down 40% health. Flipping heck. Uh, damn, I've got to say, Abyss Walker King, bro, you are smashing this today. He is getting him real good. So this is the time to get him. When his axe hits the ground, then you're going to get the dude. Alright, so he's spawning in his helpers that pretty much just sit around and watch and do nothing. Uh, don't know why they're just sat there doing nothing like they take one hit and they're dead honestly they're, they're essentially pointless uh, <laughs> They are literally pointless. Okay. This is the time to get the furious rot not you're gonna do it Abyss Walker King now was the time um, Flipping out this this is an intense battle honestly. This is a good good battle. So let's see where this ends up Okay, so the Furious Rortnor is only on 20% health. The Abyss Walker King is on probably roughly the same. To be perfectly honest with you, uh, well, let's see if we can actually get in close. It's only going to take one more hit from the Abyss Walker King to kill the Furious Rortnor. Flipping hell, this battle has been intense. The Furious Rortnor almost took the Abyss Walker King down, but then the Abyss Walker King did his healy thingamabob and went up to 50%. He's done it again. The Abyss Walker King has healed up again like a ledge and it is only going to take one more hit from this abyss walking to finish them all off and it is getting flipping close and flipping scary tight oh can't even see come on come on we've got this guys we've got this uh who are we rooting for i have i don't know who i'm rooting for i don't want to see the furious rot destroyed to be honest come on it's only going to take one more hit. Come on! This is this is flipping mental. Come on! Who's gonna win? The Abyss Walker King or the Furious Rotnor? Come on, guys! Oh, come on, come on, Abyss Walker King! Come on! You got this, bro. You have got this. One more hit is all it's gonna take. Oh my goodness! This is this is ridiculously tight. Come on! No, I want to see what happens. All right, come on, just get the. Okay, this is it. This could be it. This. Oh, come on! Yes, that's it. It is it. It is over. The Abyss Walker King has freaking done it. My goodness me. Flipping heck. That was an intense type battle. That was that's probably been one of my favourite battles I've watched in a while, guys. And uh, that was great, great fun. I really enjoyed that one, not gonna lie. Well, there we go. That is one to the Chocolate Quest Report mod. And let's put that in the loser pile. So now we have Lich versus Naga. So the battle isn't even over, guys. No, you come back here, Naga. Okay, there you go. And Lichy Lich. Let's do it. Alright, so Naga's got his aerial advantage, but the Lich has its magical abilities. If you can get his ranged projectiles on target, it should take down the Lich no problem. Um, it's not really seeming to be able to take this dude down, though. Okay, so where's everybody's health? At Lich is going down in health stats. Uh, Naga is at 86% health, so I think the Naga's getting taken down. Oh, flipping heck, that's a big hit for the Naga, surely. Surely that's a big hit. So that's about a 10% health drop for the Naga right there. That's a miss on the Lich's part. So whenever the Naga is going in for these uh, front up close combat attacks, what is the Lich doing here? What is this move? Boom, he summons these. He has summoned some zombies to help him out. But I don't presume the Naga's too fussed about them. They can't really do much. All right, what's this lantern thing? These are new awesome abilities. I like these. Flipping heck. So the Zs are actually being useful unlike everyone else's summonings. So he's bringing out more. He is bringing in more Zs. There is an army of these guys now. Flipping heck. The Naga, I don't think, stands a chance, to be quite honest with you guys. The Naga is out of this one. This is going to be one to the Chocolate Quest Report mod. And boom, boom. Is that it? Is that? That's it? It is over. 
it is over and the lich is pretty much unscathed not even 80% health uh, not even down to 80% health flipping heck uh, boom wow that was a twist and turn of events well I say that I probably I pretty much expected that one so let's see if it will be a draw today uh, maybe uh, do we do these against each other I've been not too sure uh, it'd be a long long battle today so Shelob I've got to say you do not look as cool as the 1.7.10 version I must say okay go on go on do it team do it okay Shelob is already battering this guy really wow okay so what flipping heck but Shelob is frozen in place she has become the ice spider this is actually gonna be a tight battle I reckon um, for whatever reason that melee attack isn't really doing much Shelob is not moving why are you not moving you seriously can't still be frozen in place honestly okay come on come on do something Shelob do something move for pity's sake no that is it that is a quick final battle and that's it that is another to the Moses mobs so they are the overall winner today guys i hope you enjoyed today's mob battle yes furious rot not celebrate like a champ uh tim this one was for you this was your suggestion great great suggestion thank you very much and remember guys if you want your suggestions uh brought up put on the board and done in any mob battles you've got to subscribe to the channel hit that notification bell and then slap that like button uh yeah then i will put your names and everything on the board and as always guys thank you so much for watching until next time see ya